Hello, this is Dr. Victoria Skirbo, and this is your astrological weather for Saturday, May 24th. Today the moon is in Aries, and when the moon is in Aries, we do like to start things, and there's a lot to uh, start today. Hopefully not too many fights. <laughs> uh, the, actually, the Aries moon activates the uh, Grand Cardinal Square, and also activates the... Um, Grand Water Trine. The activation of the trine, however, is an irritating aspect, um, uh, an inconjunct aspect, and so there needs to be some emotional adjustments made today. Um, the big story, actually, is something um, that has been, it's a cycle that's been going on since uh, 2000, and that is a cycle between Jupiter and Saturn. Jupiter and Saturn are now in a trine to each other. They have been uh, close to exact today. They are actually exact. Uh, they've been close to exact for uh, mostly the whole week. This, uh, there are two types of trines, and this happens to be a 240 degree trine, which is a trine of understanding and a trine of dissemination of knowledge the uh, initial conjunction of these two occurred back in May of 2000, and, uh, 2000 actually, and uh, it happened at 23 degrees of um, Taurus, and at that time we planted seeds for a new uh, cycle around uh, what is essential in our lives, uh, a new cycle of um, uh, what it is that we wanted to bring forth. Uh, this is a 20-year cycle, and so uh, it affects society and it affects us as well. And so wherever that conjunction was uh, is where you planted a new seed. And right now uh, it is actually manifesting and it is coming out uh, into the public eye. And so, uh, and the public eye accepts it. Um, it is a flowing aspect. And so we actually have uh, a harvest of sorts at this time. So enjoy any um, and the fruits of your labor. So whatever you've been uh, working on for the last 14 years, we have uh, a, a time of harvest and also a time to be open to not just our own opinions but to the opinions of others who have had this similar cycle. So. Uh, and along with uh, the, the uh, Grand Cardinal Square and the Grand Trine and a few inconjuncts that we have in the sky, um, we really can make a difference with our knowledge base, with our understanding. So it's important that we share what we know uh, to be true for ourselves at least, if not for um, everyone because everybody's truth is um, personal to them and we all have a right to our own truth trying to impress your truth on to somebody else is not um, really integritous it really is about finding what is true for the individual and then going out and seeing uh, that there are actually quite a few people who hold the same uh, truths and it's time for uh, similar vibrations to vibrate together and that's what's happening now so look around and see who's vibrating with you and uh, know that all is well have a great day and I'll see you tomorrow